Hello, my name is Thomas Heenan. I'm going to be discussing my entrepreneurial fellowship. So I'm based at the Electrochemical Innovation Lab at UCL in central London. And I'm going to be discussing how our technology is developed, where the fellowship comes into it, what the real world impacts are, and how you might collaborate with us if you're interested. So to start with the technology, it began as a four-way collaboration between myself, Dr. Tan, and Professors Brett and Shearing, all part of the EIL. And our general idea was that if we could reduce the other potentials during fast charging, then we could get to a higher state of charge in a shorter period of time, thus reduce the overall charging time. So we went about testing this on cells that were made by the inventors, very much pre-commercialization, just to get an idea of whether it would work or not. And we established that we could get about a 10% charging time reduction on those cells. So moving to uh, larger scale and commercial materials, we looked at things, uh, cells on the size of a sort of smartwatch scale, and we achieved charging time reductions of about 67%, which was very exciting. And then we filed for a patent, and that's when the fellowship began. So the main aims of the fellowship were to establish statistical confidence in the numbers that we were achieving, develop some form of cell versatility, and then begin scale up to larger applications such as battery electric vehicles. So our main impact would be in portable electronics, as I say, but also construction, motorway services, battery manufacturing, particularly for BEVs, and potentially cold weather operation. So I want to draw a particular highlight in the motorway services. For instance, if we can reduce the charging times that customers experience there, we can improve the customer satisfaction substantially, particularly if we're talking about orders of magnitudes. But then also, if we can reduce the formation cycles, for instance, during battery manufacturing, we might be able to reduce the cell cost. And if we can do that, we might be able to bring the battery electric vehicle price down for the consumer, which would also be very appealing. So our three main targets at the moment are charging times, temperature ranges, and capacity. So if you're working on battery formation or fast charging, please get in contact with us and we could potentially show you what we can do with our devices and how much quicker we might be able to do that for you. But also our, our proof of concept for the temperature range study is now under development. So if temperature is a bottleneck for you, also please get in contact. And finally, we see around a five to 10% accessible capacity improvement for all of the cells that we cycle with our device. So you're never going to improve on the theoretical capacity of a particular chemistry, but the accessible capacity, if that can be improved, then we can achieve something that's more favorable for the consumer. So if any of these three areas are something that you're working on, and it could be a collaboration for us, please email me. So I'd like to say that if you have any ideas that could potentially have commercial viabilities, then I would strongly encourage you to apply for an entrepreneurial fellowship. The, entre the fellowship has accelerated our commercialization considerably and also opened us up to uh, different ideas as to how we might apply this in the real world. So I definitely encourage that you apply for one.